So this is Carlos Morgan. I'm Kwame DeMond Mason, Director of Soul on Ice, Past, President, and Future. The truth is Sean. Hi, I'm Colleen James. I'm Fitz, the Whip Vanderpool. Hi, this is Barry White. Hey, y'all, I'm Rudy Blair. You're listening to Black Exposed. Black Exposed. Black Exposed. Black Exposed. And you're listening to Santa Tyler on Black Exposed. Black Exposed. Yeah. And now it is my honor to introduce Juno winner and one of the faces of the next generation of Canadian hip hop, Havaya Mighty. I've been so hot cause I'm the pilot son Them shorties piling up You wanna be the runner up or you gon' tighten up Listen, learn to roll a blunt for me and light it up Be the best, better on your block Yo, who block? Both your man and your girl gon' fly Go who fly? Yeah, we go cause the world don't stop Yo, who stop? Come on, baby, better earn those stars If you pull up for a hand and I'ma reach ya If you pull up in the chat, I drop a beat ya Got you coolin' like a Carolina beach ya Got you coolin' like a on the beat ya to Black Exposed with Sandra Tyler, KW's first and Canada's only show on primetime FM radio with black content and all black Canadian music. Kicking off tonight's show was last year's Mel Brown Music Festival headliner, Juno winner Havaya Mighty with So So in Protest. It's Tuesday, May 23rd, which means we're gearing up for the Mel Brown Music Festival this weekend. Featuring Canadian hip-hop icons, Socrates, and several incredible Canadian artists. Juno winner Carlos Morgan chats about his upcoming album, Where I've Been, Where I'm Going. His collab with Socrates, plus a sneak peek of a new single on his album. And I'm putting the Black Canadian Artist Spotlight on artists performing at this year's Mel Brown Music Festival this weekend. So let's start the party with two incredible Mel Brown Music Festival performers, reggae artist Amoy Evans with Sorry, and Juno winner Sean Jones with She Said. 
I'm Sandra Tyler. This is Black Exposed on 98.5 CKWR. Here we go again. I'm about to lose my mind. So sad my heart is broken. I done went and pissed off my mind. Yeah. If you see and tell me so. Sean Jones, a Canadian recording artist based out of Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. I've been singing for around 20 years, first with the Juno Award winning group In Essence, and when that group broke up, I decided to go solo. Since then, I've made albums, I've toured the world, but I now have a residency at a place called Casa Loma in downtown Toronto, where my band The Righteous Echo and I throw down soul classics all night. The thing I love most about being a Canadian artist and the Canadian music scene right now is that it just feels like it's, it's buzzing everywhere. It feels like the entire world is talking about us. We've always had great artists. Always had great artists. There's no doubt about that. But right now, I mean, it's like the weekend. We got Bieber. We got Drake. There's a spotlight that's on Canada and everyone is talking about it. And it's just very, very exciting as a Canadian artist to see this happening and to be a part of it. Oh, God. 
has it No makeup yet, she is flawless And I wonder what it is I did To wake up next to beauty like this Like the picture in the frame My Mona Lisa has a name Now I know love Oh but a her complexion Her lips are now my obsession Her eyes, they come into question If I stumble upon her love Her desire made a claim Nothing will ever be the same Cause now I know Welcome back to Black Exposed. I'm Sandra Tyler. That was reggae artist Amoy Evans and Sean Jones both performing this weekend at the Mel Brown Music Festival with headliner and hip-hop legend Socrates. Coming up, two black emerging artists performing at this year's Mel Brown Emerging Artist Showcase, May 27th. Taraj Garad, an Ethiopian Canadian who co founded the KW Poetry Slam with the song Black Gold, and hip hop artist No Invite with the song Moonlight. I'm Sandra Tyler. This is Black Exposed on 98.5 CKWR. Black Muslim girl. With the brilliance of many suns and the wisdom of many moons Where every phase is a better you Look at the divide at worst while they deny our worth Prayer bead woven fingers when we are triggered Then proceed to whisper scripture and strive Higher than the brand of justice that was promised here Here in the in-between Here in the you can't hear yourself loud enough to hear your dreams I know this system makes you nervous sometimes But your nervous system was designed to feed you feeling Impulse through your pulse for healing Your winter's withering in your bloom while holding on to their truth your blackness has always been in season Fire in your soul, you hold more than they know Shine and let go, that glow is so magical Black Muslim girl, you are more than magic You are powerful, they can't even more than magic. You are a multitude of dope fly out of this world. Love making love to love. Melanated masterpiece. There is nothing tragic about you. The tragedy is living in the kind of world that brings you the kind of grief that has you digging the earth with your teeth. 
Duality wrapped in your tongue as you code switch deep enough to be black and Muslim, but rarely at the same time. Your spine is a site of intergenerational trauma, and they mine your back until it cracks and exposes the black gold from your backbone that was sought. But this is not a minery. We are the kind of tired you become when you're both the product and the labor because apparently there's a bed here on our backs that some will sleep on yet call themselves woke. Firing your soul, you call a wolf and they know Shining like gold, that go is so magical Black Muslim girls, you are more than magic You are powerful, they can't even imagine You are black gold, black gold, black gold Show me some love. They back from talking on my name. Now they try and take me out. I'm in the five star restaurant. Tell the waiters bring all the steaks out. I had to go get a yeah, baby, we paid now. I had to go get a yeah, baby, we paid. Yeah, I can feel the jealousy when I step in the room. Go get high with me, baby, get high as the moon. In the moonlight, get the moonlight. Yeah, in the moonlight, get the moonlight. Thinking all of myself, I just look up in the moon. I swear I can't see what's going on. Tell me when the moon's right. Yeah, I'll meet you on the moon. In the moonlight, when the moon's right, I'll meet you on the moon. In the moonlight, when the moon's right, I'll meet you on the moon. The Melbourne Music Festival is May 26th to 28th, featuring Canadian hip hop pioneer Socrates. A celebration of black music in KW, music education, and diversity. Black emerging artists and black music legends Faith Amore, Denise Williams, Sean Jones, The Arsenals, Douglas Watson, John Corbin, and Socrates. The Mal Brown Music Festival, May 26th to 28th. Free tickets at malbrownfestival.ca. Hosted by KPL Central. Coming up next, we sit down with Juno winner Carlos Morgan. We talk about his upcoming album, Where I've Been, Where I'm Going, plus how he's curating the Mel Brown Music Festival. And we have a little fun with him as always. I'm Sandra Tyler. This is Black Exposed 98.5 CKWR. This is my life, my life, this is my life, my life, this is my life, my life, this is my life. My life has been filled with a lot of pain, sadness, sorrow, and abuse. I've endured through a lot of abandonment, rejection, belittling, and I was told I would never amount to anything or be anyone deserving of love, happiness, and success. I've made many repeated mistakes, and I've made many poor, selfish, and hurtful choices. It took me a long time for me to realize that I am worthy of love. I'm deserving of the best. So if you've been through and endured hardships, heartache, and disappointments, declare to yourself that this is my life and I am worthy of love, life, peace, success, and happiness. This is my life. Welcome back to Black Exposed with Sandra Tyler. Juno winner Carlos Morgan joins us to chat about the Mel Brown Music Festival and Symposium, May 26th to 28th at the KPL Central. Carlos is not only the curator, but he's also the producer 
Welcome back to Black Exposed, my friend. We missed you. Thanks for having me, Sandra. Thank you. Guy, you've got a new album coming out in the fall. What is different about the second annual festival? Well, we have some brand new performers. Some of them include Amoye Evans, five-time Juno-nominated reggae artist, Varese Marcel Bowen, gospel artist, Douglas Watson, blues artist, Socrates. Wow. Yeah, Socrates will be performing with classical opera singer Denise Williams, accompanied by Andrew Craig, and together they're known as Melanate, Faith Amore, who's doing jazz, and uh, Sean Jones, a a very popular, well-known R&B soul singer in Canada. May 26th and 27th, they're going to be held at the Kitchener Public Library. This year, they're going to be at two locations, again, the KPL Kitchener Public Library at 85 Queen Street North, and uh, Church of the Good Shepherd, which will be held on May Sunday, May 28th. I'm going to have the youth performance again. It's really great to be working with you and Nathan Stretch and the Willingham extended members of the team, which includes Sam Navy and John Corbin. For the young listeners, who is Socrates? Man, in terms of hip hop artists in Canada, I'll start in Canada. I put, I personally put Socrates in the top five hip hop artists in Canada. That would be alongside Maestro, Mishi, Cardinal. I put Shock Lair in there, the Dream Warriors in there. For me, Socrates, <laughs> as a, as a lyricist, his voice, and not only can he rap, but he's, he's got a really distinctive singing voice which yeah. I really enjoy. I love his singing voice too. And actually, my new album that I'm releasing called Where I've Been, Where I'm Going, um, I'm featuring him on one of the songs called Belong to You. I'm really excited about Socrates. Any hip-hop heads who are out there who are listening to this, come to the show, to Socrates' show, on Saturday, May 27th at the Kitchener Public Library. And if you want to hear real hip-hop, not the hip-hop that y'all kids are into today, come and check Socrates out. Take some notes on what right. hip hop, lyricism, flow, music, production, vibe. Last year, one of our featured performances was Havaya Mighty. She had just won the Juno Award for Best Rap Album, and she was the first female artist to win Best Rap Album at the Juno Awards. Bayern laid it out last year. Socrates is going to lay it out this year. So y- y'all come out, hear Socrates do his thing. Man, I'm, I'm really looking forward to hearing him. Check out his music online. Check out his music videos. Done a lot of production for Julie Black. Done production and works with Shaw Clear. Um, he's worked with uh, Red Man, Method Man, members of Wu-Tang Clan. He's international. I'm blown away. This is fire, Carlos. Fire. Thank and you. you and Socrates go way back. Yes, you do. You know, yeah. Juno and MMVA and SOCAN and UMAC and every other award winner, Carlos Morgan, he comes from that era of when hip hop and R&B started just making the music scene over 30 years ago in mm-hmm. Canada. He has worked with and he knows Maestro, Julie Black, mm-hmm. Chuck Lair, Northern Touch. Like he mm-hmm. grew up with these guys, all of these musicians. He is part of that crew. Carlos, you are a legend. I am really, really excited because you have a new album coming out. Tell us about yes. that. So the name of the album is called Where I've Been, Where I'm Going. It's going to be a double album. It's going to be two parts. I'm releasing 10, 10 songs in September. And then I'm releasing another 10 songs next March, God willing. So the first part will be the first 10 song is the Where I'm Going chapter. And then the Where I've Been chapter will be released in spring of 2024. And then I'm going to start touring. I'm going to be making vinyl and CDs. So at my shows, I'll be selling them, which I know include the liner notes and songwriters, producers, all the credits of who worked on the songs. And the first single I'm hoping to release will be a gospel inspirational song that, that I wrote and co-composed, but I am producing with Monique Spence. And it's a gospel song featuring gospel artist uh, Michelle Adams. And the song is called Come Take My Hand. So the album is, it's a journey of my life. The first part of the album will be songs around heartbreak, relationship ending experiences and ups and downs in relationships. Then there'll be a couple of songs that will be about my personal life. And the second half of the album, where I'm going, will start with 
experiences of like Have Little Faith, Long Hard Road, which is my favorite song on the album. And then I'll move into songs about love and falling in love, which Socrates will be on that particular song. I'm actually going into the studio this afternoon to continue working on Come Take My Hand. I've done some co-writes, again, Socrates being one of them. I've written with Grammy Award-winning producer Matthew Gerard. I have a duet with another Juno Award-winning singer who is from Kitchener. Her name is Miranda Walsh. She won a Juno along with her sister, Mystic. And then I've done some songwriting with Daryl Joseph Denny. We have a very romantic, beautiful love song on the album called Spend the Night. Cesaro Grant Jr. and Colin Monroe, we wrote a couple of songs together, one of them featuring a sample of Billie Holiday's vocal in it, taking it back to the early, mid-2000 neo-soul sound. Got a couple of songs that are influenced by Marvin Gaye, Prince, and D'Angelo. And then there's some new songs that has the new, there's a combination of R&B trap, but not so much on the trap side. And yeah, and then I've written songs with guys like uh, Temi and Chris Sandy, uh, or goes by the production name C Sharp. A song I'm really excited to release is called I'll Die Loving You, which features a sample which I interpolated by an old 1970s classic song called You Make Me Feel Brand New. You make me feel brand new. I've always wanted to ask a musician this question, but I just never had the chance. But I'm going to ask you, yes. since your album is based on relationships and heartbreaks, how does your wife feel about you writing about the past? I'm not married, but my ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, well, let's see. Uh, there's actually one, maybe three, two or three songs on my album that was inspired by my my marriage when I was married. So I don't know if she'll hear them, but if she does, then hey, a lot of songwriters write about their lives. Taylor uh, Swift. Taylor, she is like, if you want to learn about someone's life and 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 relationships, put her on. She like puts it out there. I was inspired by artists like like Marvin Gaye. His songwriting for me and how he told stories and shared about his life is a huge inspiration for me. It gives a window into a songwriter's life, but it also tells a story of everyone's life. You're in relationships, the highs and lows of relationships, and unfortunately, when relationships don't last and the heartbreak or all the emotions that go with it when you are so invested in someone your heart soul body mind and spirit are entangled and entwined with someone that you've uh, fallen in love with you you think this is someone that you're going to you believe and think this is someone you're going to spend your life with and then it doesn't go doesn't happen or you do end up getting married and then the marriage doesn't work out and you're going through divorce and there's heartbreak and all this deep pain. And I had that experience. I wrote a song about it. And even sometimes still now, I'll listen to the particular song. There's one particular song called Fallen Through that's going to be on the album. And I say, I'm lost, confused. I don't know what to do. Our love is falling through. There's no more me and you. I went through that. I was, I felt lost. I felt this huge gaping wound when my ex-wife and I split up, stuff was oozing out this, and it just was for weeks, for months. And I'm sure everybody who's, or most people who's gone through a divorce can relate to that hard pain. But writing that song, just listening to it over and over and over again, for me, helped me through a lot of what I was experiencing. None of the songs I've written are like, I'd be like, oh, I hate you and you this and you were that kind of, you know, I wouldn't write something like that. And if I were to, I would be still very respectful. Yes. For example, one of the songs, uh, you dehumanize and demonize my feelings and you rarely speak the truth. You've made me the culprit to everyone I stand accused. We could have made it better, but you weren't willing to try. So I'm ready to, so I'm ready to lose you, girl. I'm saying goodbye. I could say how I feel by saying, you know, this is how you were to me. I still love you. I still care. But I couldn't say these feelings. We're having some problems and I'd like to say how I feel, but I can't say it. So now, you know, but anytime I tried to speak up, I felt I was being silenced or not being heard. And then I would get angry 
I get so angry and then I feel like an idiot. I feel like a fool. So I will express those feelings of angst. I'm going to do it in a way where I believe it's respectful. And people be like, yeah, that's right. You tell her. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> or, you know, a woman will hear that and be like, yeah, you, you tell him. He said how I feel. You know what I mean? <laughs> so. <laughs> I'm dying over here. <laughs> I love you. I love you so much. <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> You're hilarious. You always brighten my day. Do you think a woman's scorn that's been written about that they've ever tried to sue for royalties because it's about them? I've not heard of that particular scenario. I have heard, and I, but I can't remember right now who the artist was, where they wrote a song. Oh, and you hear it all the time in hip hop, especially, where somebody will write a song about an experience. The person that the song was written about, I don't know if they necessarily sued the person. I think they threatened to mm-hmm. sue the person. I don't think they, was, they threatened to sue the person because they felt they were being slandered or defamed. Well, it's yeah. kind of good then that you apologize to all the women in your life and your song. <laughs> yeah, and some of them would be like, <laughs> I remember one, I remember one still friends with this particular ex, and we were talking a few months ago, and I said that I've written songs that were inspired by her, not particularly about her, and she got upset. Well, yeah, I mean. She said, no, she got upset that I didn't write a song about her. She said, Oh, about her. <laughs> yeah, she said, you wrote a song that I inspired, why didn't you write a song about me? I like, uh, uh, I don't know. Okay. Have you ever put your exes in your music videos? No, but I would like to. Yeah, I don't think, uh, I don't think. I don't know. Or, Separate you know, green rooms. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. If I reached out to an ex and she were to, she'd probably, initially she'd probably say yes. And then when I tell her what the song's about, <laughs> what the story is, would be like, I, I ain't doing that. But what I would like to do is find someone who looks close to an ex <laughs> yeah. and have that look alike in the video, you know, and then say, okay, well, you didn't be in it, but I found someone who looked like you. And I said, okay, act like this, say that, look at me like that. <laughs> I have a great music video idea. <laughs> oh, you do? You know, we go to Fitz's gym. Okay. We, we we find a a bunch of actors that look like your exes, and we just stick you in the middle of a boxing ring, and while they punch the shit out of you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nah, come on, you're not that bad. You know, you're a very inspiring person on the mic, off the mic. You know, you are who you are wherever you go, and you're always inspiring and emerging artists, like with the Mel Brown Festival. So the Mel Brown Festival is in a few days. It's May 26th to 28th. Yes. You can go to melbrownfestival.ca. Tickets are free. And again, go to the melbrownfestival.ca. And Carlos, please come back with your new music. Come back. You're always welcome here. You know, thank you're you. always, thank you're you. always a co-host on this show. So thank you. Thank you so much. And, um, and, and to you, Sandra, for all the work that you're doing for the Mel Brown Festival, music festival and for Black Exposed, this is an incredible platform that you have and that you're doing for the black community for the community in general and definitely for the black community highlighting and featuring and exposing black the black experience black people and what the black community is doing and are doing in uh, the uh, waterloo region this is a wonderful wonderful platform that you have and and i'm so deeply deeply grateful to you can you sing us out uh yeah let me see well let me see okay this one's called we're gonna make it uh, which you can see on the youtube you can see on youtube my music video for we're gonna make it on youtube or you could go to itunes to download it or to spotify and stream it and it goes like this uh, if there's a way that we can keep our love together and if there's a way that we and make our love much better I don't want to be alone Cause I know that I can take it But if we work this out That's how we're gonna make it Wow, Carlos Morgan, everyone We're gonna make it We're gonna make from it, the, y'all 
from the album that's set yes. to release September 22nd, and you will hear it first on Black Exposed. I love you. Yeah, baby. Thanks, brother. I love you so much. When you love, you don't stop. Uh-huh. Tonight's Black Canadian Artist Spotlight is Sudbury's own Cordell Ronan 705 Miller. He combines his influences from hip-hop along with the nerd culture. He brings well-thought-out melodies and sharp lyrical barbs to all his musical creations. His songs represent the Nickel City with the song Flex Chicks. I'm Sandra Tyler. You're listening to Black Exposed. I know I already gave love to my Nickel City queens, but uh, on this one... Yo, when I'm alone in my room, like 
like yo, L on the classics. Needing love that someone I can match with. Think it's you, it's true, at long last it's found the proof. We've reached them greener pastures. Yeah, we'll never freeze, ever stall. To hold you down proper, cause you seem to be the type to like the G's on the call. Plus, you stay fly when we out, like you be an R piece on the wall. Look, angelic, so heavenly. With a freak side, you know, stay tempting me. Down shit, even go split rent with me. It's why in my heart you be at what hope never be. Shine like the sun, give it rays. While some hoes. I bring in drama for days, but hey, cause do you see the wrong in my way? So now coming through on the song, giving praise. Hey, one love for the flex chicks. Head to toe, stay fly on the press chick. Got the own, not stress in the next chick. Be the ones you want, not want flex with. Yeah, so two times for the flex chicks. Hold it down with the crown, they the best chick. Be types you want, grow, get checks with. So one love for the flex chicks. Yo. Try and be a power couple like Yonce and Jay Maybe Big Sean or Janae Cause you go give the kind of love Never walking away It's like a grand tsunami How your wave feel in my heart Anytime you slam it on me Try and stay afloat with your glam Till I be try and make videos Like we Pam and Tommy Sorry Fuck shit a chat Never mind in the talking about this and that We sitting back grin crack While I'm painting raps Killing tracks for my queen Like we revving Pat Yeah See it's more than words to me Point is they at where you deserve to be So I'ma keep serving she And keep the city burning up to the third degree It's like One love for the flex chicks Head to toe stay fly on the fresh chick Got the own not stress in the next chick Be the ones you want I want flex with Yeah So two times for the flex chicks Hold it down with the crown They the best chicks Be types you want grow get checks with So one love for the flex chicks. Yo, on that job to never let your smile fade. Uh -huh. Down the aisle with your girls is the bridesmaids. Miles away from the type side sideways. Vintage love like Kangos and high fades. Yeah, see, I love your flow. That's why you litty in the city get treated like a pot of gold. Knowing you a treasure, so bet you I'ma take it slow. Till we at my crib and my bed clothes optional. Too real, no similar looking. Type by get knocked straight, come to the book and getting me hooked in like a Drug. So you know when hot sex on the platter, I be loving your cooking, ayy Shine like the sun, giving rays While some hoes try bringing drama for days But hey, cause you see the wrong in my way So now coming through on the song, giving praise One love for the flex chicks Head to toe, stay fly on the press chick Got the own, not stress in the next chick Be the ones you want, I want flex with Yeah, so two times for the flex chicks Hold it down with the crown, they the best chicks Be types you want, bro, get checks with So one DKP, love for baby. the flex chicks Yeah, if you holding down your man, your fam and friends With the last dollar in your hand Understand you a flex chick Yeah, say so you a flex chick Yo, yo, if you be holding down your man, your fam, and friends with the last dollar in your hand, understand you a flex chick. Damn right, you a flex chick. I'm Fitz, the Whip Vanderpool, six-time professional boxing champion, three division pro champ, and you are listening, Black Exposed. Who's the guy? Who's the guy? Listen, I'm not going to find out nothing. You know they call me Black because I'm an African. I am Black. 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 I am black, 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 you gonna change that, I am black, I am black, lots you can change that, I am black, I am black, lots you can change that, I am black, I am black, lots you can change that, you call me black, 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 cause I'm an African, I am black, 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 lots you can change that, I am black, 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 lots you can change that, I am black, 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 lots you can change that, you call me black, black. Cause I'm an African I'm an African, I'm relevant Treats me like a diamond I work so hard for my daily bread Stop treating me like a alien I'm no difference like you I play safe for my crew It's the same blood and avenge It's the same pain we feel I want no war but peace I don't wanna bring God to my peace So save me free justice So save me free justice It is one life, we all got Why you gotta try to take my Stop bullying, protect 
me, stop bullying me, stop fight back I ain't care about the colors, I am black Being racist, I am black Asian or Brazilian, I am black Indian or Australian, I am black Poor man or rich man, I am black Still fast or golden, I am black Life knows we all want, military men, civilians I am black, I am black Nothing can change that, I am black Nothing can change that, I am black Nothing can change that, you call me black Black cause I'm an African I am black, black, black Cause I'm an African I ain't care about the colors I am black Being racist I am black Asian or Brazilian I am black Indian or Australian I am black Poor man or rich man I am black Still fast or golden I am black Black knows we all want Military men, civilians I am black I am black I'm Sandra Tyler with Black Exposed In case you missed it last week Canadian hip-hop legend Socrates headlines This weekend's Mel Brown Music Festival This is Socrates Fades Away Featuring King Rain and Drake I've been counting every penny, every day, getting grown. Seems nothing's wrong, but it feels like I got an empty head. Cause one comes in, one goes out. At least I got a reason to sing a song. I guess I'll go. Remember that classy Sinatra? Fly me to the moon, Quincy Jones was an offer. I wish my life could be as perfect as that was. But even Frank, like he couldn't dodge a coffin. We listen to Frank White and Machiavelli often. James Yancey got the d- deep hopping. Watching them do it, I learned an audible option. To put Toronto number one on the top ten, Socrates rocked them. Until it all just fades away. Obama but rocked them. Some greatness lined it up in your darkest day. Dr. J to LeBron James, James Brown to Mike J. Me to tell DIA. It's ill to why spirits come again and again. Even haunted as Kurt Cobain. J. Cole train, trouble men like Marvin Gaye. And hey, I live today like Marley Mack and Martin. To see you on the top 10 King Rain. Got it all just away. Yo, Got it all now here stands the story of your life, homie. I got the light. I'ma pass it to the right. Look, to the right. give me the torch. I will carry that shit till I can. Till I'm Jerry at trick. When I'm sick and a glowing ball and my blackberry don't click and I relocate someone and marry that quick. Until Jay don't make my day. Wayne don't sound the same Return each year and be back better than ever Since late it's better than ever And we like syrup and pancakes We better together My nigga still chop bees like it's ever the letter You stay around for a while but it's never forever So Until it all just fades away I guess I'm gonna go Until it all just fades away Until it all fades away Until it all just fades away Fades away, yeah if I'm gonna play this game, I'll put a dollar on your dime I'll put in time, now where's my money? We living on the playing board, roll the dice, my name. we trying to score And put a little food on the table, it'll be just fine I guess I'll go I guess I'll go How you feeling? My name is Socrates. I grew up playing a lot of sports and, you know, still still enjoy playing. So to affiliate it to the beginning of a, of a football season, of a basketball season, you know, the amount of buzz that goes on worldwide. First of all, you've got new beginnings. That falls in line with, with the listeners who have been around for a while are familiar with the work. And for the new, a refreshing journey. I find that diehard fans are praying when we pick up that album, we are going to get maybe that, what you, what a sports fan would call that, one of their favorite athlete, or what I would call in music, that favorite song. Might not be the single, that the lead single, you know, it, it just ends up being uh, wishes granted. The public who are aware of, of what I do 
I like to keep them on their toes so they never really know totally what to expect besides quality. Yeah. Word up. Yeah, yeah. Socrates in the house. About to turn it on now. Keep it up. Word up. Figures of speech. Take over the whole world, baby. Word up. With my staff, where we got? Check me out. For the time ticks on through the early morning breaks of dawn. I'm an emperor whose empire crushes the porn. I gave birth to a novel scene. Still in the green, Ooh, blow out your smoke screen. So free, please, cause it's MC and never read the great. Can't have a punk spilling head cheese. Socrates, a felon. In the rap game, rebelling. I rock stadiums like Van Helen. Bruce Springsteen, what is war good for? Even when cash rules, you still lose my Quoting the words of a shoddy When who is becomes who was And who could have been will never be somebody All I want's a green in my jeans The earth is mean, so I plot mad schemes Wild for the night, being polite You're drowning in sh** creek without a fight What, some old psych shit? You wanna battle? Touch the mic and see how close you might get A bust you missile click and send you back to your dimension of whackness Doors blocking in with a backflip So then the beat becomes Shank. Let the fat woman scream it ain't over till I finish my skank. Following the footsteps and you can flow to act around the way. Every day's a payday. Crooks are living the life of kings in the ghetto. Emeralds and fat diamond rigs. Stay alive and strive. Let a nigga know that you're real. And quit playing Leonard Part 5. Recognize my rhyme. My Valentine's Day of deadly love. Powerful like Daddy Tom. Keep checking your watch before I took in your home plate. I'm Jackie Robinson. You better dodge Brooklyn. My map will never crack. So and I got mother nigga <laughs> down to nothing. Ah, uh, an asset to the ramen biz. My nigga, nigga, nigga never ask me what time it is. I'll kick a quiz and go sphinx on your ass and ask you if a nigga falls in the ghetto, will they harass you and ask you? Sit and think a deadly venom starts to sink to your fucking skin and melts to your lips. The shaman getting low on Tango Ray. Flip the script on a AR stifle in Mazar and A. Promising is comforting to the fool, but worth some of the time. But word is born. The smirk, son, better be. Be white by tomorrow night, Nito, capiche, or I'ma have my way like Carlito. If the time runs out, then brother, you will get turned out. And if the clock keeps ticking, then nigga, you will lose no doubt. If the time runs out, then brother, you will get turned out. And if the clock keeps ticking, then nigga, you will lose no doubt. If the time runs out. All right, here's what's happening around town. You know the Mel Brown Festival is May 26th to 28th this weekend at the KPL Central and the Good Shepherd Church featuring headliner Socrates. I'm not sure if there's any tickets left, but go to melbrownfestival.ca. I know since we've announced headliner Socrates, they have been going fast. Dig Millennial presents Afro Vibe on Gawkle Saturday, June 3rd from 2 to 9, celebrating, elevating, and amplifying black culture from Africa and around the world. Guyanese Fit Chick, the leading digital Caribbean fitness trainer, is now available online to help you with your workouts. Check out her classes at GuyaneseFitChick.com. Now here's some summer concerts and festivals worth noting. Amanda Marshall performs at the Center in the Square June 21st. I'm definitely going to check this festival out. Nelly presents the Hot and Her Festival June 24th at Downsview Park, Toronto. Wait till you hear the lineup. 
All right, so it features live performances by Nelly, Yayo, Akon, T.I., Fat Joe, Rick Ross, Ja Rule, Chingy, and of course, wouldn't be the same without Carrie Hilson. Tickets at hotinher.ca. That's hot in H E R R E.ca. And that's what's black around town. How many times must I yell? I can't breathe. My voice fading fast from the weight of my screams. What else must I do to prove I'm hurting? I fear for my life, yet the world fears. My skin Tell me How long It's too long Waiting for hundred years The pain, the hurt, the tears You tell me You see nothing That's it for tonight's Black Exposed. Special thanks to the Juno winner, Carlos Morgan. Look for his upcoming album, Where I've Been, Where I'm Going, releasing September 22nd. If you haven't got your tickets for the Mel Brown Music Festival featuring headliner Socrates, I suggest at some point you try to find them on the black market. Or you can go to melbrownfestival.ca and see if there's any left. Next week, I sit down with music industry pioneer David Click Cox, who helped launch the black music scene in Canada and was head of artist and repertoire at Universal Music Canada. So if you're an artist, you're going to want to make sure you check out Tuesday, May 30th show, 6 p.m. You can find me on my socials at Sandra Tyler and at Black Exposed 98.5 CKWR. Black Exposed is Canada's first and only show on primetime FM radio with black content and all black Canadian music. You can hear Black Exposed 
exposed every Tuesday at 6 p.m. Stream live on CKWR.com and stream after on Spotify, YouTube, Podbeam, Samsung, and most other streaming services. Stay blessed, everyone. I'm Sandra Tyler. This is Black Exposed on 98.5 CKWR. Celebrate each other's blackness in every shade. Good night.